all right guys so welcome back to father's day this is officially episode number two if i recall correctly we are now playing with jonathan and we're about to head into the woods uh we've got a camcorder here from the last episode that we saw and uh yeah let's do this shall we Look, look at that achievement. Summer of 58. Oh, man. These are the same people that made Summer of 58, I, I believe. I got to crack open a cold one here. Hold on. It's, it's Diet Coke. It's not alcoholic. Okay? I promise I'm not a raging alcoholic. All right, so how do I zoom in? There we go. So I think we're actually in the same cabin that we were at the beginning of the game. Yep. But as you can see here, it's no longer here. This is, was it 20 years before or 20 years after? The trailer is here. Oh, it is here actually. Never mind. Okay, never mind. I, I. Oh, uh, seems to be locked in from the inside. Oh, shit. Yeah, I... I would hope that you guys are wearing headphones like me. If you are, you would have probably heard that. All right, hold on. Let's, let's see if we can go inside. The pumpkins are still for sale for two bucks. Some things never change. I need a crowbar to open up the window. Okay, so we're going to go inside this house illegally. Uh, what is that? Well, I'm going to check behind the, the trailer. Okay, there's an arrow over there. I would assume that's probably where we have to look. But let's see if I can open up this door. No. This is still here. You've got to be kidding me right now. Oh my God. Bro. Oh my God. All right. I have to say this game these developers know how to like just throw these you they know how to throw these subtle just little scares at the right moments so this lady's not here when i'm around here she's only she only appears when i'm on the other side which clearly lets me know that she's scared that's weird. The arrow was pointing the other way. Oh, shit. Bro, am I tripping out? What the f- I was just here on the other side. Okay. Little baby, settle down. All right, well, we've got the crowbar. Which is exactly what we needed. If you think you're going to scare me at this point, <laughs> I've been through it all, sweetheart. Okay? Maybe a couple of years before today, maybe I would have been a little... I need to shut the fuck up. Here we go. What? <laughs> if you guys never saw Summer of 58 here on the channel after this video, I recommend you go see it. It is by far, perhaps, one of the scariest games I've ever played. Not only in my life, but on this channel, like period. It is 
it is insane that game drove me into madness quite literally is anyone here is anyone here what is this nasty latex glove it's gotta be somebody upstairs <laughs> you already know bro can i unlock this i need to burn the rope okay so let's see if we can find ourselves some delicious pizza left over your brother jonathan this is the letter i sent to emma that son of a bitch stole it i knew he was guilty bro those are are, are those fetuses just being cooked emma your neighbor doesn't bother you anymore i know you're kind of uh you're kind to him and your son likes him but he seems strange to me his name is phil and he lives alone i've got something on him he had a family they got into a car accident his wife and child died after that he moved into an apartment in your house i don't think you should talk to him your brother jonathan he moved into an apartment in your house or is that right an apartment in your building perhaps maybe some sort of efficiency bro what is going on in this fucking game I should probably keep the uh, night vision on as it's giving me a more clear view. It's him. <laughs> that's the that's the thing from the clown. Uh huh. Here, I need an access key. Okay. He was here. Okay. Uh, I need to find how to open the safe. Okay, so we've got the lighter. Now that we've got the lighter, we can probably burn the rope on the door. Probably. I need a lighter and fuel to burn the rope. Okay, where's the, how do I get the fuel? Hold on. Circus performance. Happy Father's Day. Here's the... Ah, oh, lighter fluid. Gotcha. I will say I do like how this game... You know, keeps coming back and forth. Finding certain items and shit. Okay. What is that? That's, that's not normal, man. Oh, God! These stupid ass noises are gonna drive me to insanity. All right, we're probably in a different dimension now. Every time I go inside and come outside, it's, it's everything is different. Notice the arrow wasn't on the RV anymore or the trailer. Sorry guys, just I, don't, I really don't mean to scream for no reason. I'm somewhat of a puss. What can I say? <laughs> Jonathan, uh, I took out the axe. Oh, man, they put the access card in the toilet. That's disgusting. All right, let me, let me just go check over here. Um, not really out of necessity, but uh, uh, out of curiosity. Here, uh, I can get it with a hook. Okay, so I'm probably probably have to go back. That's the longest fucking fishing rod I've ever seen in my life. Oh, we're gonna go back. I, I would assume we'll get the hook inside once we do everything we gotta do over there. I just wanna make sure that I'm kind of not leaving things behind. I I'm assuming there's gonna be secret things that I might miss. I heard that there's a decent amount of things that you can explore onto in this game, but at least for the obvious ones, I. I <laughs> Yo, 
can I close the door? Like for real? No, I can't close the door. Here goes. Dear goodness. I didn't find uh, his diary. Uh, I didn't find this diary in reality. I need to dive into it and find out what happened to, to him as a child. Why he is hiding these memories. Came home after school. My mom was in a bad mood. I had to sit in the basement again. Oh, we're going into the story of the diary. Jonathan. Oh, fuck. Here we go. Nah, home sweet home. Mom. <laughs> ah, dude. Oh my God, I don't like this. I'm sorry, mom, I'm a little late. I'm sorry, I was just trick-or-treating with my friends. That's all. I'm looking over here a lot, I'm sorry. I'm supposed to be receiving a computer today. Hopefully it gets here. Oh, awesome motherfucking bullshit. Jonathan, uh, you've gone too far. You want to know the truth? I couldn't read the rest of it. I'm sorry. Oh my God. All right, hold on. It feels like this is a compilation of like a bunch of their games. Not a compilation exactly because it's not like all of their games compiled together, but it's, it's got a lot of uh, references and... Bro, what is this shit? <laughs> Bro, what the hell? Oh my goodness. This is really good. Like, this is... This is legit. Tonight, two patients escape from a psychiatric psychiatric hospital. A man and a woman. They present themselves as a married couple. Enter into, uh... Trust. Uh, ent uh, enter into trust and can harm others. Uh, be careful not to come into contact with them. If you suspect anything, call the local police. I will definitely call the local police authorities. Okay. Don't worry. Hopefully today we won't have to call the police. Hopefully today will be a day of uh, uh, nothing but uh, pure happiness. Mom? Dad? I'm back. I'm a little upset. Jason got more candy in there than I did, but... Uh, Seem to have found a lockpick. I found the lockpick. That's interesting. Okay. Apparently, uh, I'm an expert locksmith. Ah, uh, actually, close that shit. I do not want to go there right now. Let me explore everything here. I hear noises. I don't like these areas where everything is super tight. And I feel like there's somebody watching me at all times. Somebody might just pull up and tickle my ass. I don't know. Bro. 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 What is that? I'm just clicking away here. Basement. Is this the basement? No, it's not the basement. All right, hold on. This game is just trippy, man. Oh, that is that that is the basement. You're kidding, right? Yeah, my boy. I'll be right back. I'll be I'll be right with ya. When I go outside. Let me, let me actually come back. Let me close this door. No, I can't close it. He's there. Fuck. I don't know if I should be heading in, into this area. I don't, I don't know. What is this? She did, uh, she hid the keys. I find the lockpick. You know, uh, how to use it. 
Okay. We've got the lockpick. I'm assuming I should use the lockpick downstairs. No? Oh, it's right here. Oh, shit. Yahoo! Alright, should I go? I don't know. Where do I go? I'm rotting pumpkins. This family was like obsessed with pumpkins, huh? And mannequins. Creepy as shit. <laughs> What? What? Stop! Hey, man, come on. Let's just... Can we not be so damn aggressive with the spooks? Can we just, like, you know, throw them in there once in a while? You know, every 20 minutes will be okay. Not every three minutes. That's what you call excessive. And these mannequins look really- <laughs> Oh, God! They had to throw the little girl in there now, didn't they? What is this? Uh, mountain farm. These Polaroid uh, pictures. I wonder if I can like, probably like hold a couple of them. It's too dark. What is this? I don't know what that's used for. Hmm. Yeah, earlier before, when it wasn't that dark, I could turn off the flashlight and kind of interact with something. So I'm just kind of hoping that it's not the case here because I can't see anything without the flashlight. But I was saying, look at the mannequins, like how they have this like thing on their elbows. Just look really good. They've done a really good job with the mannequins. Very spooky indeed. Taking my time. No need to rush this. The fucking doll is no longer there. I don't know if you guys have noticed, but the doll is no longer here. It has left. It it actually looks like Jigsaw. J was that the name Jigsaw from Saw? Truth be told, I've never seen the Saw movies. I know I should be ashamed of myself, but why would I sit here and lie to you guys and pretend like I did when I didn't, damn it. And then I know I know the video games are really good, but truthfully as well, if I were to play those games, I'd probably get demonetized. Those those games uh, based on the movies could be pretty crazy. Probably wondering why. Uh, how do I know these things if I've never seen the movie or played the game? Well, everybody knows that Saw is super crazy and full of gore. And why am I talking so much right now? Well, it's basically a uh, standard here on the channel. I'm trying to keep my mind occupied. Don't hate the player. Hate the game. Okay. Oh, we got a couple of pink cans over there. I'm going to keep walking back here. Oh. <laughs> we are in a cemetery. Oh. Bro. Oh, what the fuck? Nothing good is going to come out of this. You know this, right? Like, we, we know this, right? Rip. Jonathan Pierce. Anne Marie. <gasps> oh my God. What is this bullshit? After my parents were taken away, I ended up in an orphanage. Ooh, could that be the orphanage from, from that uh, one game we played? Wow. There I found friends and it seems I became happy. The monster that lived in me calmed down and stopped appearing. I wanted to find a family that would accept me for who I really was. A normal. Oh, man. Would that be the orphanage from Summer of 58 or whatever it was called? That would be crazy. All right, I'm out of here. Hmm, I don't like this. So we're going to go back into the house and uh, we've got the uh, that little orange thing that we acquired. I'm not sure what that's for, but we're about to find out. There's also the bathroom. Tell me that's not freaky, bro. All 
We need three keys. Okay. <laughs> hey there, little Tommy. You want to stop making a little splash pad? came to the bathroom. We've got a lever of sorts. We're probably going to need to use this. Oh, okay. We're good. We're clear. Flush the toilet. It smells in here. Oh, God. No, don't do that. No, you did not just do that. You did not just do that. I am headed inside. I need to find a crow. Where do I find a crowbar? Are you fucking kidding me? Okay, we gotta find another crowbar now. How do I find uh how do I take a look at my inventory? That's the thing. I'm trying to My inventory. I don't know I don't know how to do my Tab is not inventory, neither is I. Yeah. Hold on. Okay, we've got some bolt cutters. Locked up. See, that's another one of the games that we play locked up, right? This game is driving me insane right now. An undeveloped photo that needs to be. Yeah, this game uh, is just, again, a minute compilation of all their games. Phil? Bro, this is crazy how they've compiled all of these uh, uh, ideas. This kid is not Phil. Then who was it? About to find out right now. An undeveloped photo. No, take that picture again. Fuck. Ooh. Yo, what is this? Hold on. Ay, Dios mío. Me cago en la mierda. Hello? Jesus Christ. I need a bolt cutter. Okay, here we are. We're back downstairs. Dude, I wish I could see the damn pictures. I don't... I don't remember anything. I hear some noise here. I'm just going to be taking pictures galore because, quite frankly, I... Yikes. I bet it's something really stupid, like for me to check out the pictures. Alright, take a picture of the bathroom. Nothing here. We're gonna go over to the cemetery now. I think that's what we're gonna do, but before we do that. Nothing. Probably take this to the yeah to the back. Fuck. Now 
now I'm getting really spooked because it's like I gotta come back here again for whatever stupid reason. I know the cemetery for sure. Let's see if I can find anything here. Where's my inventory, man? Fuck. Hold on. Here at the cemetery. Ah, oh, is that why we have pictures here? So maybe it's wherever there's pictures. Oh my God. Yes, yes. Bingo. Gotcha, motherfucker. The little doll is no longer there. We got to go to the red, uh, the red, uh, the red cabin. The red cabin we go. Okay. So we're going to guide ourselves now. We don't need an inventory to check out the pictures. We just need to go. And whenever we see Polaroid uh, images on the ground, then that's where we got to pull out the camera, which makes perfect sense. But clearly when you're on the pure terror, you don't really think straight. What the fuck? Yeah. Hold on. How about we put that on pause real quick? We're going to go back over here. And I'll catch up with you in just a gif. All right, let me hold on a second. There we go. All right. <laughs> All right. All right. That's bullshit. That is absolute horseshit. You are super wrong for doing that. So wrong for doing that. Yeah, look who's there. Yeah, you see him? Yeah, you see her? She's an asshole. Wow, bro. They did not just do that. That fucking hey! A little girl crawling like that. Oh my goodness. That should be illegal. <laughs> I got the crowbar. Stop, 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 stop. What is it the kids say these days? Stop the cap. Stop the cap. Stop the cap. Wow. Your goodness gracious. This is uh, pretty intense. All right. Well, we got both the things we needed, right? We got the bolt cutters. And we've... Ooh. Steven and Nancy. We returned to our house, but others lived there. I needed to get rid of them and get my life back. I had a child. He looks so much like my Phil. With him, we can start all over again. Little Peter. We are your new mom and dad. And, uh, my food has arrived. <laughs> she wanted to start over, but something went wrong. Well, that's too bad. Oh my God! There's no way in heck my life expectancy does not go down every time I play a game like this. There is just absolutely no way. At this point, I should start a GoFundMe or some shit, because... OnlyFans? Just kidding. Maybe. Maybe not. Feet pics, anyone? <laughs> no. Never mind. 
Yep, you got it. Okay, I didn't say anything. Stop. Bro, you need to chill. You need to chill with those fucking running moves. Like, that is just not even funny. That's not even remotely funny. Like, not even one freaking bit funny. All right? You come at me, I'm pulling out the Polaroid, bitch. I dare you to come at me. Look at the wallpaper just like peeling out of the walls. Chicken's foot. Ay, ay, ay. Ay, Dios mío. Ay, mamacita. Ay, ay, ay. Hi, guys. The whole gang is here, I see. <laughs> the whole gang is here. Yeah, yeah. I was sick in the head. Yeah. Oh. It worked. It looks like the lock in the basement has opened. A knife. From day to day. That's probably another one of the games that I don't know if I played. I probably have, but, uh, all right. You guys are going to chill out. All right. And that little shit is not. shut up all you have to do is tell me to be quiet one time which you did so now I'll shut up okay oh my gosh the pieces to the puzzle oh wow I need two more oh that's the train <gasps> oh that's the train right there bro it's actually quite genius how they've piled all of their games into this one like this is cool Barbara Finch Shut up. You're not funny. Oh, I think she's crying. I don't know if she's crying or laughing. I don't know what the fuck's going on. Thankfully, the flashlight does not have battery, man. <laughs> if the flashlight had a battery, I'd be dead. I would have to start all over again. This game would have been over. Please, just don't do that. Ay, Dios mío. Really? Huh. It wants me to put the tape. A child who craves parental love becomes rejected because he is not like that. I needed to help Phil to find freedom. I calmed down when Phil was safe. To the accident, Phil asked me to help him get his family back. We tried many times, but it didn't work out. And Phil only got worse. Okay, 
Yeah, this game is fucking intense, man. I'm not even exaggerating when I say that. I, I mean it. I was left alone. I decided that if we wouldn't get his real family back, then I could find a new one. While I was thinking about it, I remembered our house where we were together and decided to take a look at it. Okay, come on. When I got home, I saw a baby. Phil, you take care of me. Come on, move it along. It's like taking forever to read this crap. I mean, I know my reading sucks, but it's not that bad. Sheesh. I tried to convince Phil to go to Father's to the Father's Day celebration on Sunday, saying that your life would change there, and uh, he refused. Every time I'm drinking something, I'm like scared to drink because I think like a jump scare is going to happen. I'm going to get all spooked and spill everything all over the place. So then I went there myself wearing my best outfits. I wanted to amuse the children. It's kind of weird. I met my father. I met, uh, I met my father with a child. Uh, it was a boy from our house. He treated him badly. He wasn't his real father. I made sure he was left alone and went over to him. Or maybe it's meant to say I met a father with a child, not I met my father with a child. Or maybe, I don't know. His name was Peter. Subconscious uh, is more adequate than you. And you must understand that you are evil. You made your parents monsters. They killed Peter's parents because of you. Emma lost JJ because of you. I am a monster. I am a monster. Fuck. Mm. All right. Fuck. came home after school, my mom was in a bad mood. I had to sit in the basement again. Oh man, this is nuts. This is fucking nuts. Jonathan. Alright, so we're back to reality. Good. Good. Phil's diary. Camcorder. Take that. Emma, your neighbor doesn't bother you anymore? I know you're kind uh, to him and your son likes him, but he seems strange to me. His name is Phil and he lives alone? You got something on him. Okay, we already read that. This is the letter I sent to Emma. That son of a bitch stole it. I knew he was guilty. That's right. I'm just going to make sure there's nothing here. I'll undo that. Okay. All right, let's just get out of here. Okay, whoa, fuck that. Damn, if I would have gotten the, the puzzles, probably would have been able to put it together for that train area. area. Like the puzzle in the basement we saw. It was part of the find yourself game, the train area. Ah, look at that. A hook. Okay, so we're going to go back here. Oh, goodness gracious, stop it. Oh, my God! Fuck. Ooh. What is this? A s mini saw or something? Okay, the disc angle grinders is damaged. It's enough to use it once. 
Come on, man. You're a mannequin. What are you doing? Don't play yourself like that. Oh, huh, right here. I didn't even know this was here. At least not on this on this part of the game. The disc is broken, but who cares? Open up the We're damn door. Pretty high up here. Get a little bit scared for you. I gotta come all the way back down there now. <laughs> Bill. Oh, dude, this is that that. Oh man, this is the circus spot. Oh shit. This is intense. I think there was more jump scares possibly in this episode than in the first episode. I mean, it was just nonstop. But uh, we've got about another hour left of this game, and we will hopefully conclude it within the next episode. I, I hope this one does well. I hope you guys enjoy it. Um, if you'd like to see the grand finale, just let me know. And man, the developers have, I think personally, they've done a really good job with this. So far, it's really good. And uh, thank you guys for watching. Hope you enjoyed. I'll catch you on the next one.